It's got the redesigned dash down in the center if you look. It has a lot of touch instead of buttons and you can have a panoramic sunroof. Okay, that's one of the big differences. Also, don't trip on that. You're going to notice the space in the back. Pretty good. These seats are down, but a little less space in the back, a little less space as far as width than the Telluride, right? Let's go back to the Telluride. Nineteen twenty twenty tire rides, but look at the dash. This is the mo this is the most recent refresh for the twenty four, but it still has a lot of buttons and stuff, right? And if you look up at the sunroof, you have two sunroofs. Okay, but you know what it's going to come down to, and in the back, you know what the tire ride looks like in the back. It's got plenty of space. Come on up front here. Now, what it's going to really come down to for a lot of customers is one thing: towing capacity. This has a big four-cylinder, can tow up to 4,500 with the X-Pro down to 2,000 towing capacity. This, everyone on the Telluride trim tows 5,000, the X-Pro tows 5,500. So now you know, I want to get the Telluride versus the Sorento, but guess what? These cars are getting, every day, getting closer and closer to the smash hit the Telluride. So really, Oh,